This video tutorial is just a basic tour of your Warren County Public Schools Gmail account. Um, so we're just going to start off once you have accessed your account and have logged in. Uh, over on the left hand side you have the red compose button. So if you wish to compose an email you just select the red compose button. You also can go through all of these labels. So anything that you have starred in your email, you can click starred. This is very similar to your Google Drive where you can start things in Google Drive uh, as a way of organi organization. Um, so you can star emails and they will show up in your starred label on the left. Uh, you can also mark emails as important. You can access your sent mail over here on the left. Uh, and also any draft email that you have. Categories, uh, these are also similar to labels. Um, some people might consider them like folders if you're thinking back to Office 365 email, but uh, emails that come to you that are considered of the social category, um, so like Twitter notification emails might go into your social category by default. Um, promotions, so like uh, anything that is a promotional email from a business might automatically be categorized in your promotion category. Um, so those emails typically go into those categories by default uh, and don't traditionally go direct to your inbox and that's just a way that Gmail helps filter emails that come to you. Also if you click more, uh, all chats that you have within your Gmail, you can access all chats, all mail, spam, your trash folder, and you can manage your labels and create new labels. Uh, labels are just a way of organizing. So in the past, you have created folders uh, and your emails have gone into those folders. Labels are not folders. They are simply a designation, um, a, a label. Uh, so it doesn't take them out of your inbox necessarily. It just puts a label on them and categorizes them. Um, also, you have your chat window um, in your Gmail, and that can be moved to either the left or right side. Uh, up at the top, you can search your Gmail. So if I want to search anything from matt.crestline, I can search, and it pulls up emails that I have sent or received um, from Matt. You could also do this little drop down arrow and search for uh, emails that way. And then over on the right hand side is your settings cog or settings gear. You have your main settings. Uh, if you click on settings, your themes, uh, you can your, adjust your display um, so your emails appear larger, the list of emails appear larger or smaller, more compact. Um, if you click on more, you can mark all of your emails as read. You can refresh your email by hitting the refresh button. Uh, this drop down allows you to filter through all of your emails, read emails, unread emails, starred and unstarred emails. So this is just a basic tour of uh, your Gmail account. You can also access your contacts and task by clicking on the drop down arrow next to mail. By default, it's on mail. Um, so to sign out of your email account, you just click on your profile pic of your Google account in the top right, and you click sign out. This is the exact same um, as Google Drive. So when you do this, you will likely be signing out of a Google Drive window as well.